The motion to table passes. Mr. Bafuma, you're recognized for your final three and a half minutes. Thank you, Mr. Chairman. I reclaim my time and I ask the question, where in the world is Rudy Giuliani? That's how we got here, ladies and gentlemen. And this committee is afraid to bring him before us and put him on the record. Shame. And the question was raised, what does this have to do with it? It has everything to do with it. Professor Gearhart, in your testimony, you said in every impeachment inquiry beforehand, the House has identified some credible evidence of wrongdoing committed by a targeted president. Is that correct? Yes, sir. Professor Gearhart, are impeachment, impeachment inquiries typically utilized as a frontline tool to go fishing or for the first time go seeking evidence? Uh, no, sir. Professor Gearhart, would you say that House Republicans have made an unprecedented overreach of congressional power? Uh, it, it strikes me that it is, yes. And Mr. Gearhart, would you say it's fair to assume that the extreme MAGA Republicans in particular have misused, if not abused, committee's resources and the taxpayer dollars in this prolonged investigation that has gone on for almost a year, subpoenaing documents, having hearings, providing boxes of evidence, and no wrongdoing. Um, sir, I appreciate the question. I'm not sure who the MAGA Republicans are. So. I can point them out to you. <laughs> Mr. Now, Chairman. Here's, here's the, here's Mr. Chairman, uh, I would ask that, that the gentleman please point out the Republicans he's referring to. He said he could. This is, I'm reclaiming my time. Ladies and gentlemen, this clock is showing what's happening to our country while we debate over and over and over again, not any wrongdoing by President Biden, but trying to link what his son may or may not have done to him. People are going to be hurt when this time runs out. This is not the Wizard of Oz when all of a sudden she turns over the hourglass while the wicked witch is standing there. These are children, these are women, these are military officers and soldiers and civilians, these are law enforcement officers, these are senior citizens looking for paychecks for Social Security. Why in the hell are we playing this game? And why don't we be honest? If it were so important, it could wait. This is what is important, protecting this government and protecting the people who pay taxes here. But we want to play games with all of this. So where is Ju Rudy Giuliani right now? I'd like to know. And I'd like to know why we can't bring him before this committee, like we brought these witnesses and everybody else. I yield back hey, my Mr. time to the ranking member. Well, I want to thank the distinguished gentleman from Baltimore for his uh, passionate and lucid comments here. Um, and I, I appreciate the fact that you introduced a motion to subpoena Giuliani before I'd introduced a motion to subpoena Giuliani and Lev Parnas. Now, Lev Parnas wrote us a long letter saying that all of this is based on a fraud, a tissue of fraud. He went all over the world with Rudy Giuliani looking to is, find is dirt. Is he alleging that China money but, was a fraud? I'm, are you asking Romanian me to yield? Money? Are you yeah. asking me to yield? It's a, I, I'm happy to yield for a second. What, what, what is your question, Mr. Chairman? What, what fraud are you? Well, you, uh, I've introduced it in the record in case you haven't read it yet, the letter that Lev Parnas wrote to you and to me. In it, he called upon you to call off this wild goose chase. Because of China money that the Bidens have received? No, because all of this is based on the Burisma conspiracy. The, the China, China money is based on the Burisma conspiracy. Well, I've seen you're, a lot of China money. Mr. Mufume's time's expired. You can, someone to. can yield now, uh, Dr. Fox from North Carolina for five minutes. 